Marcy Anderson with the Fishing Report for Southeast Kentucky. On the Cumberland tailwater, the Creel clerks are seeing good numbers of rainbow trout in the 10 to 13 inch range, and 8 to 11 inch brook trout are also being caught. Anglers are having success using spinner baits and silver buddies. Some walleye are also being caught in the tailwater with reports of good catches near the dam at night. Striped bass can also be caught below the dam and also near Winfrey's Rock. On Lake Cumberland, walleyes are being caught on the main lake near the mouths of major creeks and tributaries using bottom bouncers rigged with night carlers and 30 feet of water. Striped bass fishing has been good this summer with fish holding in the upper portion of the lake longer. Currently, stripers can be found between the dam all the way up to Fishing Creek. Elsewhere in the district, Finn's Lakes were stocked with channel catfish the week of August 7th, so check out Brickyard Ponds in Barberville or Logan Hubble Park near Stanford. Good luck and good fishing. This is Tom with your fishing report from the Northeast. Out on Grayson Lake, anglers are having luck on the sunfish with Popeye jigs tipped with wax worms. It might be a good opportunity to try out some fly fishing for the bluegill up there as well. Crappie and bass are deeper for the bass. Fish slow with Carolina rigs and deeper running crankbaits. And of course, this time of year, night is your best bet. Hybrids are slowing down a bit, but you can catch them down by the dam deeper, basically sitting around top of the thermal climb. Anything that looks like a shad will be your best bet here. Greenbow Lake is a hotbed this time of the year for catfish. I'd be fishing at night with some cut bait for the channels in the lake. There are a few flatheads, and for those, you'll be fishing live bait. Also on Cave Run, hydrilla beds are getting pretty heavy right now. Keep in mind the importance of cleaning your boats before you move to other lakes with this incredibly invasive weed. That should do it for me. Wherever you go, good luck and stay safe. This is Rob Roll in the Northwestern Fishery District. Our two major reservoirs, Nolan River Lake and Rough River Lake, are both at Summer Pool and holding steady. Bass fishing is still fair at both reservoirs. It's best at night. And blue and black combos of either jig and plastics or spinner baits seem to be working the best. Catfish are still active at both reservoirs. Best is fishing at night along the steep rocky banks. If you're targeting channel catfish, you can use cut baits or any of the prepared, commercially prepared baits. Angler's doing well at all of our Fins Lakes, which were stocked last week. Wayman Morris, Pants Creek Park, and Yellow Creek Park. Madisonville City Park in Madisonville. That's an update from the Northwestern Fishery District. Please remember, be safe when you're on the water. Always wear your life jacket.